because I'm in this situation is my external flash memory is full. Before you take a card out or take this off, make sure your camera is off. It's like pulling an SD card out of a out of a computer without shutting it out. Uh, I'm taking this off because it's full and I'm putting on the blank. Uh, I, I don't use it all the time. Let me put it on here where it goes. And your A and B, I always record on A with B overflow and it goes to the external drive. This is a 128 gig flash memory. It goes there automatically. The way I set this up is you come on I will memory card access A and B it's on B and I want to be on A just like so but it'll automatically go to B when A is full and it automatically records to here the other day when you called and said your ND filter was flashing this is what it was it was on ND1, it's flashing, you need to go to ND2, you got ND filter 1, 2, 3 is built in. Uh, here's what I do on my, on my focus. I use auto focus, but in manual mode, see auto and manual, uh, I think that's pretty similar to the AX2000, uh, but in manual mode, that way my iris is manually controlled. Of course, you know that you have all your your controls in several different places here, here, and here. Uh, here's the way I do my white balance. Of course, make sure your lens hood is open. And you go into it. You you do it just like this right here. You push your white balance like this. It'll start flashing here. And when it's set, it will stop. Just that simple. There it's flashing. See the white balance symbol? And when it's set, this is showing it what white is. Moving on to DB gain and all this, I always go as low as I can go. You got low, medium, high. There's your auto iris. Presets A and B, I go to A. If you want to know your shutter speed or change your shutter speed, there it is right there. There's your DB gain. Of course, all this, you know how to control all that. Your status check, your profile, yada, yada, yada. That's not no big deal. If you, I don't know if you've assigned your assign buttons. I have on a few of mine, uh, but not all. Your audio levels uh, is self-explanatory. You got input one and input two, uh, which what I do is my front one. I always put this shotgun mic on input one and input two is always my wireless mics. Now I'm using three sources of audio now, which I just started doing. I'm using a Rode uh, shotgun mic, a Sennheiser wireless mic, and the Tascam. And what I'm doing with this is I, I had to order a shock mount for this because you could hear it. Is I'm I'm gonna mount this on here and run it through the Tascam and into the camera because this has a SD card in it and I will get a recording, an independent recording of the audio on the Tascam whether I use these mics or not. Shotgun mic will be here, wireless mic will go here, and I'll get an independent recording here, and it'll go to the video. So I'll have three sources of audio, which is shotgun, mic, uh, wireless, and this. And I can turn these on if I want, or turn them off. It has a headphone jack, uh, audio levels, a mixer, and it runs on three AA batteries. Not, not real complicated. Uh, nice little addition there to the thing. Of course your AX2000 is just like this as far as you have your your zoom focus and iris control uh, just like mine. Uh, there's not much difference there. 
your tripod, I almost always use it. If it's on a tripod, I'm pretty much using this because it seems so easier to me. It's got everything you want. It's got autofocus, zoom, uh, fast or slow, record on off. You can even adjust the speed of your zoom. That's a Manfrotto also. So, I'll see if I can't throw you together a decent video to, uh, of course, you know how to work uh, your, your line outs. Which is basically, I had this happen one time too. I had a wireless mic, wasn't getting anything, but it was going to here. So uh, the next thing that told me was it was a cable. So uh, what I'm recording on right now is a Nikon D800 with a Rode shotgun mic. I'm not using a wireless mic because I think that's sufficient. I'm three feet from it. Uh, Manfrotto tripods. Uh, that's what I use, a 701 fluid heads. Uh, this is all I have. I have two of these and it's, it's all I use. I use them on a modern pod. I use modern pod a lot. Uh, gosh, I gotta clean this camera. And that is a Sony NX5. Of course, it's got TC Link and all that good stuff also. So now I need to go download some footage. <laughs>